Well, this morning, the Hamilton County Coroner's Office is renewing its effort to try and identify remains of more than a dozen people found in Westfield over 25 years ago. This is a story that gathered national attention 25 years ago, and now it's coming right back into the news. Yeah, that's right. It's a case stemming from back in 1996 involving the serial killer Her Herbert Ballmeister, who police believe lured and killed his victims at his Westfield home before disposing of them on the property. Now, the case is being brought back to life thanks to new technology and DNA. Now, we want to show you this is video back from 1996 when investigators searched Fox Hollow Farms where the suspected killer Herbert Ballmeister lived. He was suspected of luring gay men to his home before killing them. And what deputies found at the home was shocking. More than 10,000 bones and bone fragments were recovered from what investigators believe is from at least 25 people. Investigators were able to identify 11 DNA profiles matching eight people who were all missing at the time. However, since then, things went cold. And now the Hamilton County Coroner, Jeff Ellingson, wants to help identify the remaining victims thanks to this new technology. Since then, there's been a lot of improvement, more technology, uh, more user, user friendly, less expensive. So when I'm asked, why now? I say, why not now? Uh, we want to get these people identified. We want to provide some closure to some families. Now, Baumeister took his own life soon after the investigation began back in 96, which is a big factor into why many victims have gone unidentified for the past 26 years. Now, Ellenson is also pleading for any family members of a male that went back missing back in the mid 80s to mid 90s to come forward to give a DNA sample. He says the process is quick and painless, and we have more information on our website, WTHR.com, on how you can provide that sample.